ladies and gentlemen welcome to my channel today we're going to this to talk about the international day against stigma and discrimination and uh, for women living with HIV I want to empower you to overcome the stigma and the discrimination we live on each and every day here are my five secrets Secret number one, own your story. It's your story. You live with HIV. It's not a lie. Stop being in denial. And uh, as you accept your story, control the narrative. There's no such things as when people tell your story. They always put spies or some sort or some some uh, sort when you didn't ask them control your narrative own your story control your narrative control your story how it's be, it, will, it will be told how it will be shared and the second step you have to practice self-love be kind to yourself you are lovely you are lovely and loving the, the sky did not fall. Life is going to continue. I promise. I am a living testimony. Life continues. So you will be fine. Don't just give up. Love yourself. Practice self-love. Practice self-positive talk. Talk to yourself as if you are a CEO of an important organization. And treat yourself when you get out of the house. Clean up yourself like uh, you're going to meet the president. And uh, your mind, plan your life as if you have a million dollars coming your way. That's the way to affront life living with HIV. And uh, this, the, 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 the third secret, allow people to, to, to have their opinions. You cannot stop people to have opinions. They have right. And there's no such thing as a reputation. When I step up in a room of 20 people, I have 20 reputation. Everybody sees me in, through his eyes and his experiences, his heart, his uh, uh, story, his past history, his past life, that's their, their business. It's none of my business about what people think about me. I can't, it's out of my control what people think. There's no way you're going to please people. There's no way your mother-in-law is going to say the, the thing you want him to say, her to say. There's no way your, student, your classmates are going to like the, you the way you want. Your, you, what you have in control is your, your own reputation. So consider yourself to be an important person. Consider yourself to be a healthy, striving woman and beautiful. And allow other people to have opinion. Don't just be petrified or, or, or be like uh, they t talked about you and then you were going to... To, to melt, to allow people to have opinion. If they are talking about you, it's because you're important. Don't go fight them. Oh, they said I have AIDS. Oh, they say I'm dying. Oh, they say I do this and this. I have, allow them to have opinion. It helps me. I never worry about what people say because I understand they have a right to their opinion. And whenever I, um, they see me, they see me through their experience their past history I have no control over that and the number number three stay in care don't give up care because you people are seeing you going to see the doctor just stay in care treatment is key HIV treatment works you will stay healthy you will be able to achieve viral suppression and you can be able to have uh, children, you can be able to live a healthy, productive life. So don't give up your treatment at any cost. 
even if people are saying and they're pointing fingers at you just stay in care the fifth one which is the most powerful for me get out of your way and share your story i know it's difficult to be out there there are so many people who cannot share their story for various reasons some may lose their jobs other may lose their houses it's a lot of happening however there's no benefit of keeping your secret by yourself get out of your way and share at least share with a family member as you share with a friend and as you take baby steps share with with your community and then share with other people i'm not calling everybody to be out there saying they live with hiv like me but i'm just asking people to get out of, of their way and get a hiv in their mind and start having the, the experience to experience hiv with the community with other people it gets easier when you shared and i hope on this international day of uh fighting against stigma and discrimination you are not the one stigmatizing yourself you are not the one uh, making negative self-talk to yourself be the first one to be the champion to fight against stigma and discrimination against you because sometimes we also contribute by feeling less than what we are you are a fully human being beautiful lady stay that way and you will be fine and join me in, in the next video bye